Well, hello, Aries. How are you? Thank you so much for being here. I greatly appreciate choosing to spend your time and energy with me. I know how valuable it is, so thank you. Um, feel free to look around. Uh, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Uh, the videos are done timeless, so if you are attracted to one, it's the perfect time to watch it. Um, information to contact me as I do offer personal readings um, as well as information to donate to my channel is down in the description box below and let's see this is going to be a general reading so please like share subscribe Aries okay as well as uh, use your own wisdom and discernment to place the energies that come forth where and if they need to be placed okay if they don't apply let them fly you'll just drive yourself crazy all right heavenly father spirit guides and angels show me clearly Aries Show me clearly Aries. Top two cards for Aries. Top two cards for Aries. Let's see what we get. Okay, ooh, we got the bee and the peacock. Beautiful. Okay, the bee is community. Okay. And it says here that you are a powerful creator. Your work blesses everything you touch. Be open to receiving sweetness. You are the queen of abundance. All right. And then we have the peacock. Vibrancy. Okay, it says that you were born to shine and inspire. Practice humility to avoid jealousy. Be grateful for life and more good things will come. Be true to yourself and recognize your brilliance. Okay, so definitely receiving uh, some blessings here. People feel your energy when you walk into a room and they're grateful for it. Okay, um, things, uh, looking for things to be grateful for yourself waking up in the morning uh, the sunshine on your face things like this being able to find your car keys all that you know um, yeah and, and when we appreciate and notice the small things then spirit gives us more bigger things to be grateful for down the line here show me clearly Aries Aries. Top two cards for Aries. One more shuffle. Pride and regret. Now this uh, pride has been coming out for all the fire signs so far. That's kind of funny. <laughs> um, but I, I love myself and I see myself in everyone. Okay, so yeah, you're working on recognizing the abundance that is all around you when it comes to people, connections, um, uh, recognizing your own self, your own brilliance. <coughs> Sorry, as I was talking, I just got a big old whiff of incense right in my face. Lovely. <laughs> All right. And we have regret. It says, I know that I cannot change the past. So there could be something uh, that you regret a little bit here. Things that you kind of, uh, I hear, need to forgive yourself for. Okay. Um yeah you're holding on to some past pains from something here something to possibly do with family okay pride here um but you have the ability to reach out to loved ones to make new connections and that and help inspire people i think you helping people to achieve certain things and to learn to shine themselves is going to really help some of you okay you can't change the past but you can learn from it and grow 
Alright, let's see what else we have. Heavenly Father, Spirit, Guides, and Angels, show me clearly. Aries. Show me Aries. Yeah, you are holding on to the past. This is something that you're working on changing with a little help from my friends, I'm hearing, okay? Um, yeah, learning how to really trust your gut and make peace. Make peace with that past. Spirit is guiding you. Show me Aries. So we have a victory for sure here, coming with love, opening up the heart chakra, all right? Um, you gained a lot of wisdom from the past. It's, it's difficult for you to kind of fully decipher everything that you've learned, but you are doing so with this. It was something that was, uh, we also have 666 here, okay? Not the devil's number, all right? Just, just saying, not, not in tarot. 666 is actually a very good number and so I think you should uh, Google angel number meanings okay and look that up there's good messages here um, yeah you're moving on to victory and success with relationships love a spiritual union that is divinely connected because you have learned something from the past here something that you keep looking back on and having difficulty um, looking forward from the sun's over here but yet you're looking back over here okay gaining wisdom with that book of knowledge so let's see what we have here all right heavenly father spirit guides and angels show me clearly aries most high message for aries show me aries Again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if any of this is resonating at all. I greatly appreciate it. It helps connect me to your energy for future readings. Aries. One more. Aries. All right, show me Aries uh, center energy, please. What's the general energy here for Aries today? Yeah, some of you could have hurt loved ones or, um, you know, made decisions that kind of didn't work out the greatest for you, things like that, but you're moving on from that. You're recognizing who you are still, okay? You could be relocating. Yeah, four of cups here. Um, there's a lot of cups here that are empty, and you're you're waiting for that one to come in here. Um, there could have been some deception here with some options, thinking that uh, somebody had options. This is you, your person. Again, you use your own wisdom and discernment to place the energies okay I gotta put this out sorry ah. getting a little bit too much <laughs> okay but you're wanting to move forward here um, being a little strategic about your decisions too and you do have a choice to make when it comes to love could be dealing with a water sign you don't have to be okay um, show me what's coming in to influence this what's coming in to influence this general energy what's crossing it
Wow. Wow, it's just insane here. Okay, so somebody could have been a bit stubborn, maybe a little controlling here. Um, this is just a side message. Uh, and you're moving forward here towards a victory, possibly moving. This could also be uh, a father of some sort, either a father of your children or your father, I'm hearing now too. But there was a lot of chaos and stuff and moving forward towards a victory to end the anxiety. Okay, they're trying to find their life's path here. All right, a fresh new beginning, but there's some codependency still here. There's um, a lot of passion. Somebody could have cheated here um, with these two energies side by side. Um, but yeah, there was something that was not working here in the recent past. Or that is influencing this. I don't mean for you to think this recent past. I just meant it doesn't seem that long ago. Alright, let's see here. What's coming in to influence this energy for Aries? Okay, also um, that third party energy, that affair. Yeah, um, independence is coming in here. Financial stability is coming in here. Being single. Okay. Yeah, something, somebody gave more than they received, wanting to bring about a balance again. And somebody's watching, okay, this is their two of, wow, we got two, two, two. Okay, big decisions to be made here, and somebody is very burdened by this. The, the energy is very heavy, okay. But what I was going to say here, too, is the, I mentioned that third party, okay, um, it doesn't always have to be another person. It could be work here. We do have a bee. Bees are very hard workers. So I just needed to say that. Um, yeah, somebody is looking for some stability to be able to take care of themselves here. Show me why we're here for Aries. Wishing and hoping that something works out in love, wanting a return of someone from the past, let me see, what's at the root of this for Aries, yeah, taking a leap of faith, okay, the wheel of fortune here, taking a leap of faith, we have three major arcana, this is a huge transformation, alright, the magician, manifesting this, taking action, a fresh start here. Yeah, with marriage here, your happiness, you got some clarity and now you've been working really hard at this. Uh, possibly with an air sign, King of Swords. Very determined here. Show me the recent past. Okay, healing, a little confusion here, got some options, healing from some options, some choices, some decisions here, and a tower moment, a big aha moment. Yeah, somebody has been watching their two of cups, and they were very burdened by what they found, spying on them. Okay. Maybe you discovered that your person was in another relationship. Yeah, had chosen another path after a long period of time. Uh, what is it that Aries is thinking? What's crowning this energy for Aries?
What's crowning this energy for Aries? Oh, okay, working really hard, being strategic to have a fresh start here in love. Yeah, wanting to offer an apology. I'm not understanding fully why you're wanting a fresh start here. Being strategic. Okay, I am getting a little deception with this as well when coming in and offering an opportunity. Yeah, it's because you've been spying. Somebody's spying on you. Getting clarity that this is where your happiness is. Okay. Somebody wanting to commit with someone. Show me near future. Yeah, you gain some wisdom that somebody is moving on with a pretty tight connection. Um, near future. Yeah, Knight of Cups taking action in love and commitment here. Yeah actually coming back in for a victory um, yeah after heartbreak I get that you were with this person for a long time. There's, um, hmm, I almost want to clarify this one just now because it's really it's sticking out to me different. It's like if you're so you know nine of coin is not just single. It's doing damn good single. You're able to take care of yourself here, and that's the only other place besides here next to the seven of swords that I see cups on this table hoping here for four of cups four of cups this is uh, boredom discontent this is looking at the past and not sure you really want it you're like huh you know you're kind of praying for it ask but but there's something with this this cup is in it a regular deck this this cup here is what spirit is offering and usually there's a young child sitting underneath the tree with their arms crossed like hmm, I don't know and they're facing the cups down here so if you're familiar with tarot you know this one here gives the illusion of of praying somebody is praying for this this cup here but they're like eh manifesting this, this is the wheel of fortune these cups are delusions uh, in love and everything is about the pentacles money so far yeah and victory winning at all costs Because this cup here, I mean, do you see what I'm saying? Okay, I am going to clarify this, but I mean, I need to, to make sure you know too. There's deception sitting right here. Because somebody is moving forward. I'm getting jealousy. You're upset. You're upset that your person is moving forward here. I don't believe that this is you, but you you place the energies where you need to, where where it fits for you. All right, Heavenly Father, Spirit Guides, and Angels, show me how Aries thinks about themselves. What does Aries think about themselves?
Again, coins, no cups. Aries, what the fuck, dude? Working hard. Really not having a mu uh, much. Things, things are tight. Out of balance. And you want to change that. You've chosen the route to change that. And to take action. But still... It, it's and and to be victorious here because you're bummed this is the card of regret these cups that I'm seeing again you are your person Yeah, you want to be deceptive. Because he's looking this way too, if you could see. His head's right here looking this way. The cup's over here. You're being deceptive with the past. Someone from the past because they're moving forward. I don't know, let's see. What, what's the energy coming in to influence this? Hierophant and the Empress. Spirit could be working with you to open you up here. Communication with a soulmate who walked away because of a third party situation. And we have justice here. King of Wands and the death, an ending for a new beginning. And it's like, is this worth it here? You're spying to watch and see if it's worth going back and offering an apology. Some of you could be wanting family, okay, we mentioned family here, the pride. You could have a commitment with this person, you could have been married with this person, but I get spirit is at work here, bringing an empress in, because here you are here. Let's see. Uh, what are Aries' emotions? Show me Aries' emotions in this situation. Show me Aries' emotions. Priestess, keep her secrets. You're using your intuition here. Very knowledgeable. But you're keeping a secret about this Ten of Cups. the outcome. What's the outcome for Aries? Two of Cups. Okay.
it's it's not making okay I, I'll, I'll tell you the energies but I got to tell you it's it's not making sense with what's happening here because this two of cups is coming after after these secrets here okay and then we get uh, you're you're watching or somebody is watching a victory having having the strength maybe to, to the strength card is strength to hold back in situations too holding back from communicating holding back from saying anything but then here's communication and we have the seven of wands and the devil with judgment and the three of swords so it's like I really want to say that this is looking really good for some of you you know you've been single a while praying for that cup to come in wanting change so you put forth the effort to work towards it had lots of options possibly but didn't take action towards them here and got a big wake-up call to a situation a tower something came in and rocked this for you being strategic not wanting to be hurt when moving forward in love okay there's an opportunity here to take action for love commitment um, this could also be um, a job okay taking action towards something that you love okay because we have working really hard here something that took a long time things were out of balance you feel like you gave more than you received when it came to work you're spending more than you're receiving when it comes to work wanting that equal give and take This is how you see yourself. And then we have the Empress here. We did see an Emperor. But we have this Empress here. That's coming in with commitment. And you're seeing this, you know this. Again, there's decisions to be made here, twos. We got lots of twos all over the place. Keeping something hidden, something's yeah. Let's let's boy. Throw one at me like this first thing in the morning, why don't you? <laughs> My goodness. Let me set that over there. Aries, you're killing me because it, it, it's very heavy energy this unknown okay I just split the deck unknown illusion secrets and heavy burden only father spirit guide and angels clarify the cards before me please for Aries Play the cards before me for Aries. Yeah, Four of Cups. Like, huh? I, I don't know. See that Four of Cups? See what I mean? The difference? For some of you, this is what you're wishing and hoping for. Yeah, the moon, secrets. Five of Wands, quarreling, fighting, arguing. Hmm. All right, let's see. 
Heavenly Father, Spirit, Guides, and Angels. Why is the Four of Cups here, please? I think we got a, we got a couple stories going on here, Aries. I'm sorry, I'm gonna figure it out. I guess I just didn't have enough coffee yet this morning for this. <laughs> Show me the Four of Cups, please, for Aries. Queen of Pentacles, yeah, uh, again, uh, financial, Pentacles, here's the Queen of Wands and Justice, like you're nurturing yourself, you're caring for yourself, Did somebody's family member pass? Like my love is in heaven. And because it, it looks like she's burying money, like hiding hiding some money, saving some money. Putting it away for a rainy day or something. That's total random. Give me one more, please. Four four of cups. Because the, the, yeah, so this is Ten of Pentacles. There's a lot of money here. Letting go. Look at that. A young hand letting go of an older hand. Aries, Aries, what are you doing to me? What you don't see coming, okay, at the bottom of the deck here, is the Knight of Wands. It's plain. It's player energy. It's taking action towards your desires and stuff like that. And then here we have an Ace of Cups. Somebody's determined a divorce possibly, but this is this is not warm, loving energy. Determined Queen of Swords to offer a cup for the Ten of Cups, and then this Tower moment hits. Clarity hits Ace of Wands or Ace of Swords. Again, clarity, happiness, the sun, the strength card, the three of cups. Somebody else is involved. You the person that you're wanting back is involved, and here you are spying, watching, holding on. To a pentacle again money this isn't holding on <laughs> you know you're guarded here and now you you want to take action uh, harsh words arguing fighting is what I'm getting with that yeah exactly with a queen of wands justice nine of pentacles Wow. Okay, we got like a lot of Aries up in here this morning. Somebody um, could also be looking for a second chance here. Something that lasted a long time, something that they thought was going to be forever. Okay, holding on to that, saving that, praying for that. <clears throat> Let's see if we can move forward here. Alright, show me this nine of coins, please. Yeah, 
you know, taking action, communicating here. Page of Swords. It's like I get it. I get it now. Alright. Ace of Swords. Gotten the clarity of what happened back here to the Ten of Cups. Happily ever after. Somebody wants to apologize. Possibly. Uh, again, maybe getting divorced here. Wanting a new start. That would be wish fulfillment. Let me see if I get another one. Nine of Coins. Because there's there's more here. <laughs> Nine of Coins. That would go with that regret. Okay, and then we have somebody who's working on family. Yeah, wanting to move forward. Somebody's wanting to move forward to get out of the chaos here. Show me the wheel, please. Why is the wheel here? somebody's got options okay somebody's got options here with a pretty tight connection the lovers we have the seven of cups and the lovers somebody's world's been rocked this is what we have right here this was the change <coughs> Somebody's holding on. Their world was rocked here, and they're holding on to their stability, letting go. Determined to move forward. Yeah, because there was a connection here, but somebody saw differently. Somebody's person saw differently. They're moving away from this past with empty cups, these options. Oh, they. Aries, come on. We're fellow fire signs. What's up? Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> Show me this wheel. Only like one or two cards, please. Show me the wheel. Why is this here for my Aries? Yeah, okay. Wanting to go after wish fulfillment. Emotional. There's the other. Okay. Something changed here. Well, why would... Okay, somebody's healing from juggling here, okay, a situation Well, they were played, this changed, somebody is going after their happiness, this is you, your person, whoever, take it as it resonates, yeah, and somebody is all stuck in their head, they're moving away from these nightmares, this is like all they're thinking of, show me the magician, why is the magician here? Queen of Cups. Yeah. Love, nurturing, healing, intuitiveness. Okay, that cup is cracked, but manifesting a new beginning here. Determined to. Queen of Swords. Well, there's fighting. Somebody is uh, possibly using some magic here to restart something. Show me the Fool. Manifesting a new passionate beginning.
Yeah, somebody might be doing candle magic, I'm hearing. Yeah, somebody's uh, kind of holding back a little bit here. Taking a leap, moving forward. Huh. Aries, Aries. Oh, somebody could be manifesting that someone moved forward and then this person will feel unwanted and they could come in King of Cups, but it's not looking like it's turning out too good. What the hell? Aries, you're killing me. Show me this tower. Yeah, tower, eight of cups. Somebody walked away. Dump the cup. You don't get this. Yeah, they got clarity and chose a new path. Went after a new beginning here, and that's all you can think about. Yeah, Aries, there is a jealous Aries energy here today. I'm going to say that. Hella jealous. <laughs> I ain't laughing at you, but Jesus, criminy. Have you ever watched Frozen? <laughs> let it go. Let it go. Four of Swords. If you gotta be jealous over a situation, it ain't your situation to begin with. Come on. Let's be real. Four of Swords. You shouldn't have to be with somebody that you gotta be jealous of. That you gotta watch. Huh. <laughs> Cause there's a stalker up in here. Four of Swords. Yeah, two of swords. You're, you're stuck. You're not doing nothing. You're stuck. You're like, what am I going to do? And there's the deception again. What am I going to show? What am I going to show? What face will I put on today? What mask? Because you're pissed. Five of swords. Oh my god. And some of you are seriously manifesting some different stuff. Look at that. Pissed off. Stuck in your thoughts. Manifesting. Okay, but somebody's you're manifesting something here out of anger because somebody got a different perception as to what their happiness is. To where they want to offer their cup. And you're just watching this happen from behind. Yeah, look at this. Aries, come on. Who the hell is doing this? You're burdened because there's an empress here? An empress here? With the emperor. There's a divine couple. Yeah, this king of swords. And you're pissed. Because somebody walked away. Because there was a third party situation. There's an Aries energy here. <laughs> Is it seriously? I'm sorry. You might have been married to this person. But you fucking cheated on them. <laughs> you cheated on them. And you're pissed? After a long time. After a long time here, you cheated on them. They probably saw you. And they took off. And you have the nerve to be pissed off at them that they have moved forward, that they dumped this cup and left for better options. Because they're moving forward in commitment with an empress. And you're down here 
screwing people in their bed? Wake the fuck up, seriously? Okay. I just want to see if this energy can just go the hell away and I can read this for the rest of my lovely Aries. Because, yeah, for my other Aries here, you took off after your wish fulfillment. This wheel, this change came in. This flood of emotions came in and you, you, after this back here, you, you rebuilt yourself. You had the strength to move forward, take a leap of faith. Okay? You got the big aha moment here that your cup was not wanted. And so nobody gets the damn cup. Okay? And moving forward. Healing deciding here what it is you're going to do you're sitting at a crossroads what is this going to be the old me or the new me am i going to go back to old ways or am i going to go forward moving on to harmony because of the spiritual wisdom that i gained here i have options i will be strategic and make sure that I don't get hurt as I move forward in love in the future. And you're taking action here. That's the other energy that's here. But there is a nasty foul energy that just makes me... Uh, really? <laughs> Go ahead, be pissed. <laughs> Go ahead, be pissed. Manifest all you want. Because if you're just down here a page of swords... Getting the freaking clarity, or even if you're the Queen of Pentacles, you know, holding on to money, trying to hide, you're gonna go up against an Empress. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, I need to move on here. This is crazy. This is freaking crazy. All right, show me this Seven of Cups, please. Heavenly Father, Spirit Guide, and Angels. Let's move forward with the rest of my beautiful Aries, please. What message do we have for them? For those that are standing on their own two feet and are doing damn good and not taking guff from no one, moving forward, just stuck at a crossroads because they have options of where they want to go. Can we, can we get that energy, please? Heavenly Father, Spirit Guides, and Angels. Why does that energy have the Seven of Cups here? And can you please remove the energy <laughs> of that other one? Jesus Christ. My bad, I'm sorry. Wow. No wonder everything was so freaking confusing. Yeah, he had options, okay? And this brings about, you know, some rivalries here. You know, people could be talking. People could be talking, whoever this was that was left in the past here, whoever didn't get the cup could be sitting there wondering, needing to heal, but the, you moving on and having options, they're pissed off, they're upset. Could be bickering, there's, there's fucking more jealousy, Jesus. Okay, somebody, somebody was played here in the past, but they learned from this hurt. Spirits working with them, they learned with this Three of Swords what it was that happened why yeah no more secrets the wheel of fortune the darkness coming to light the secrets coming to light here getting the clarity and here's this wheel of fortune that moves you towards a victory and all you need to figure out is which way am i going to go which path with all these options which path okay somebody left a situation that was very unfulfilling here they got the wake-up call. They had the strength to do it, to repair their cup, to offer in future, after heartbreak. Loving themselves, putting themselves first, and now other people are bickering at the fact, and, and I'm, I'm hearing like rumors and stuff, and it's like, really? <coughs> but don't worry about that, because people will see refrain from communicating with them C continue to do you Aries seven of swords 
continue to do you. Why is the Seven of Swords here for my Aries? Four of Cups. Yeah, because you didn't want that anymore. You don't want that anymore. Don't come in and offer me your cup. Because I learned here. I learned here. I'm choosing my own path, my own victory, and changing my own fortune. All right? You learned here. You're being strategic. You're not going to go just for any cup because it's thrown in your face. Okay? Show me this Ace of Cups here. This beautiful, abundant opportunity that's showing up for you. I hear, you know, it's been, it was offered here, okay, and you're going for it. You're just being smart about it, you know, taking your time. Yeah, King of Wands, Ace of Pentacles. Beautiful energy. There you are, Aries, standing there, going for your happiness, your long term here. Ten of Pentacles. Beautiful, yeah. Searching for that victory, okay? Ending the burdens here. Look at this. Searching for the victory. Ending the burdens here that you've suffered from for so long. The anxiety, the struggle, the nightmares, the sleepless nights. Putting an end to that, okay? Because it's been too long. Yeah, no more breadcrumbing for you. You've learned. You've learned. And you're not going to repeat that same freaking mistake. Show me the Knight of Cups here. Show me the Knight of Cups. Yeah, Knight of Cups here. Going for self-love. Okay? The emotions, deep emotional connections here. It, it's changed for you. Okay? This Wheel of Fortune. Because you're stepping in the King of Wands. You learned a lesson about someone having options and what it was like here. You're not putting yourself in a little box anymore like we saw with that card, the Queen of Pentacles. Okay? You're not putting yourself in a little box. Spirit is waking you up to realize who it is you are. What it is you deserve. And to go after your passionate desires. Alright? Show me this Knight of Coin. This is what you get. You don't see this coming yet, but this is changing for you. That Wheel of Fortune has changed. Show me this Knight of Coin. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you didn't fully go away, did you? <laughs> Okay. Mm. I'm sorry, Aries, but this one pest is still lingering here. Watching somebody move forward in happiness, celebrating life, possibly even getting married, offering commitment elsewhere. Ripping their own heart out again lover situation putting in the work putting in the work and the time to just watch them go for a victory having success putting an end to that past for a new beginning is there anything else about the knight of coin for the rest of my aries please show me the rest of my beautiful aries Knight of Coin. Why is that here for the rest of my beautiful Aries? Yeah, because in divine time, you because you stood your ground here. And spirit is working here in divine time. It's coming. That's the part that sucks though. Yeah, a victory. Okay. There's the balance and the two of cups. The true the true love connection here is coming. Okay, but you're standing your ground. You're like, no, I don't deserve this. I'm the king of wands. Are you kidding me? You treat me with respect. Honor. All of that. That change, that fortune is coming here. 
okay? It's coming, and it will be victorious. Show me this six of coins for my beautiful Aries. Six of coins. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, the fool. It, it, it's kind of, you're, you're, you're taking that leap of faith after working on yourself to, to have that equal give and take, that balance, that fairness here. Again, a victory after heartbreak. Okay? Show me the Eight of Coin for my beautiful Aries. Not the old haggard ones. We want that energy gone. Show me my beautiful Aries. And I'm talking about spirit, not actual appearance. So, Yeah, okay. Yeah, you're working to release this. You've been holding on to this pain for a long time. You're, you're, you're uh, working towards getting better, healing. Yeah, manifesting. Yeah, manifesting commitment here. Egads. The Empress. And I say Egads because that other energy is still here. Empress for a long time here. Okay, working on self. Show me this hierophant. Yeah, somebody has chosen where they want to commit and they're taking action. They're just being, again, strategic about it. What direction to go because they don't, again, they don't want to choose the wrong path. They had an awakening right here. Okay, and now they are taking action. Alright, show me the High Priestess for my Aries. Yeah, Queen of Swords. Yeah, somebody is learning here. They're going within about their Two of Cups. Here it is. They, they're they learning the path. They realize that they were dealing with snakes. They've learned from their past hurts. Okay, and now the choice is here. Okay, again, learning from the past. Learning that they were dealing with snakes. Queen of Swords. Divorced, separated, moving forward towards a victory, cutting out whoever gets in their way. Show me the Two of Cups. Yeah, coming together in union. Creating something beautiful. Releasing burdens. Releasing burdens. Queen of Wands. Expressing love, self-love here. Yeah, beautiful. Wow. Beautiful. Because of self-love here, somebody's getting that balance after a long time. Okay, the back and forth energy with a king of swords. Okay, getting the victory here. All right, with the King of Cups. Now, yeah, you know what? I'm not even going to bother with that other energy. Just, I, it's pretty distinct now. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, let me get these up out of the way. Aries, actually, for the for the rest of you, beautiful energy, self love, self care, brings in that passionate desire to move forward towards a victory. Okay, and that's just amazing. All right, and that's just amazing after something that took so long. Okay, let 
let me see here. Show me Aries, please. Show me Aries, most high message. Sudden wealth. A new pathway here. Expectations. A message of concern. Courthouse. An ending. Getting a new pathway here. Main mail. Communication. Let me scoot this up here. One more row, please. For my Aries. Okay, in the recent past here, uh, you were feeling really good. You're feeling on the right path. You expected to stay on this, and then something happened here. There's a message of concern that affected the heart here. Okay, the emotions. Current energies. Courthouse. It's a 23, which is a 5, which is a struggle here. An ending for a new beginning from the main male here. Communicating. Okay. And in the near future, we see the privileged lady, the main female, the lovers, and mature woman. Okay, so there's three women here. The privileged lady, the single lady. Okay, and we have the main female here. Uh, which is like a represents uh, you Aries or um, a, a married committed person the lovers the connection here we got the one and two right here and uh, somebody could be very concerned here about a mature woman there's messages about uh, a mother an aunt an older uh, an older sister someone that um yeah someone that is very supportive here just a moment For some of you, honestly, here we have the message of concern, okay, different from what you expected, 
all right a message of concern regarding an ending and a new beginning here an ending that's why you're single now and a new beginning here with the lovers here and this information could be brought to you by someone's mother first time I've ever seen that showing me this in odd ways For somebody, there's definitely a, a divorce here. Somebody expected this to be their path, feeling, you know, uh, very victorious. Yeah. Okay. Let's see the hidden truth and then we're going to call this. Heavenly Father, Spirit, Guides, and Angels, show me the hidden truth. Okay, for Aries. Show me the hidden truth for Aries. me the hidden truth for Aries. I want you so badly. Ooh, ooh, Aries. The hidden truth for Aries. I trusted you. I can't reach out. Okay, somebody could be blocked. I don't want to let you go. I feel so drawn to you. And I still have feelings for you. I don't know what comes next. I can't get enough of you. I can be myself with you. Wow, Aries. Okay, so you definitely could have something really good coming in, really solid coming in here. Okay, be male or female. There could be something really good coming in, something solid. All right, after an ending. I like this. I like this for you. All right, Aries, this is what I have for you. Sorry about all the confusion in the beginning. Okay, but, um, you know, it happens. It's energy. It goes all around. We get all kinds. Okay, so if any of that resonated, please do like, share, subscribe. Drop me comments. Let me know what's up. And we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.